Hey everyone, it's Brittany, and today we're going to talk about my tattoos. Um, Pedo is here to join us because he doesn't leave my side, so you will see him walking around the room. You might hear him whine or something. It's currently thunderstorming, so he might have a little freak out moment. We'll see what happens. But I love these videos. I watch everyone's tattoo videos. I love tattoos. I currently have 11. Can you put down? Already showing off. Okay, so I'm gonna go kind of in order. Um, my first one is when I was 18. And um, a little backstory. My first boyfriend that I ever had in high school, um, he was also my neighbor. I was really close with his mother and she had passed away suddenly, unexpectedly, when we were together. And she got me snow babies, um, their little collectibles for birthdays, for birthdays and for Christmas. Um, I had a little collection from her, so when she passed away, I, well, when I turned 18, because she passed away probably when I was 16, I got a tattoo in memory of her, and I added stars around it to represent my grandfather, um, a couple of my baby cousins who passed away when they were infants. Um, so yeah, I'll just show baby. that to you now. on a cloud um, with the stars representing all of my loved ones passed away um, I love it still even though it's been about 10 years more than 10 years he's gonna go crazy this whole time I'm sorry <laughs> it's like he's showing off um, and then after that one, one second. Okay, and then after that one, I got my zodiac sign is a Scorpio. And I got a scorpion on the back of my neck. I got the microdermal a few years later, um, or a couple years later. I definitely regret the microdermal, but I do have to get it surgically removed, so I just haven't had the time or energy to go do that. Um, it's a very annoying spot. It gets snagged on um, t-shirt tags, it gets snagged on necklaces. He's just messing around with everything. <clears throat> um, it gets snagged on everything. My hair, hair ties. I want it out so bad and one day that will happen. Hi, Bob. Um, so yeah, I regret the microdermal for sure. <laughs> Say hi, Papa. Um, okay, my next one that I got, I believe was this one on my wrist. Pedo! No! <laughs> I got this one on my wrist. Um, it's just music notes. It started off as one music note and I didn't like it. Got this added and I still don't like it. Um, many years ago again. One day I think I'm going to either cover it up or just add to it to jazz it up and make it look less like a stamp. I think it just looks like a stamp. What do you have now? Okay, the next one I'm going to show you is not in order, but I figured I'd just do the top half. Um, the uh, next one after this one are on my ankles, and I'll show you those in a little while. But my next one is this one on my wrist. It says, be best. Um, if you didn't watch my closet rearranging room video, 
Um, I just explained a little bit about my friend who got murdered. Um, that's for him. His last name is Best. And this is the little saying that we all have for him. So I got that right on my forum so I could see it all the time. <laughs> There's Pito. Um, I love it. I love this a lot. I wanted to add the bird as if he's flying up in a way. Um, so I love this tattoo. This is one of my favorites. Um, my most recent ones, number 10 and 11, are on my fingers. They are the initials of my nieces. I have two nieces. Um, one's name starts with an H. I'm trying to get it to focus here. One's name starts with an H, which is right on top, and one is with an M. So I put them together, and then I have a princess crown. It's not focusing because they are my princesses. Um, I need to get it retouched, but I absolutely love, I've always wanted a finger tattoo, and I love the finger tattoos. I will get more, for sure. Now he's laying down being a good boy. Okay, I just realized that the fan has been going this entire time, so I'm so sorry if you heard that, but I really don't feel like doing it over. Um, I just turned it off, so hopefully it's better. Um, my next ones are on my hips, stomach area. Um, I first one out of these ones is this one. It says love forever. The love is in my grandmother's handwriting, and the forever is in my grandfather's handwriting. Um, backstory about the stars, I was never supposed to have that, um, but the tattoo artist um, messed up. Kind of his fault, kind of not. There was a little splotch of ink next to the V in forever. And it looked like an eye, so I got that the stars added. I don't really love that part, but I do have their handwriting on me, and I love that. They're both passed away. Um, thanks, Pito. My next one I got with my brother and my sister. Um, we got sibling tattoos. We got all the same one in different spots on our body. And I got mine right here. So the three triangles represent us. Um, love it. Don't regret that one at all. Um, and then I got... He's ripping up a sock, so that's cool. Next one is this lion. Um couple meanings about this. It's just a male lion with a crown. This means strength and security. Um, I believe that I am a strong person and my security is my boyfriend and we've been together for 10 years so it kind of represents him without putting his name on me. Um, I love my lion. I think the tattoo artist did a great job. I was very nervous about getting it because when you get faces or anything like that, it could come out cartoony. I didn't want it that way. It definitely didn't, so I'm glad it worked out, and uh, I love it. My next ones are on my ankles, um, on my Achilles both sides. I got a shamrock and a horseshoe. Everyone tells me the horseshoe is the wrong way, but I was, again, 18 years old, 19 years old. Um, so not many people see them anyway. They're on the back of the ankles unless it's summertime or something like that. Nobody really sees them. Um, I don't regret them. I am Irish, um, so that's why I got them. So, um... Pain tolerance wise, it, 
none of them really hurt. Um, I have a high pain tolerance, so they don't hurt that much. Um, to me, I love tattoos. I love getting tattooed. I think it feels kind of good. Um, the most painful ones were my ankles. Um, definitely my ankles, but it still wasn't really that bad. The easiest one, I mean, the fingers are really easy. It takes a minute to do, so they didn't really take that long. It wasn't much long. I'm sitting there in pain. It didn't really hurt at all, actually. Um, but this right here was definitely, I almost fell asleep. It really didn't feel it. He's got my shirt now, so that's cool. Yeah, that's um, about my tattoos. Um, I will definitely be getting more. My, <laughs> my take on tattoos is I want to look like the girl that doesn't have many, maybe two or three, but I have tons, which I already look like that. Um, I, nobody really um, is expecting me to say I have 11 right now so that's cool i kind of like that look um i have a few ideas for my next ones i definitely want to get one for pedo who's over there this crate you know drinking some water um yeah so that's about my tattoos oh <laughs> no pop you can't have that. Okay, well, thanks for watching, and um, we'll see you in my next video.